हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल अगेन डेंट लर्निंग वे यू गेट इजी वीडियोस टू लर्न एंड रिमेंबर अबाउट डेंटिस्ट्री टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक फ्रॉम ऑर्थोडोंटिक्स दैट इज कैमेंस ग्रोथ कर्व दिस इज द मोस्ट कॉमनली आज टू मार्क्स एंड फोर मार्क क्वेश्चन इन यूर फाइनल एग्जामिनेशन सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड बिफोर गेटिंग स्टार्टेड मेक श्योर यू सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल टू गेट एन अमेजिंग कंटेंट ऑन यूर इजी डेंटिस्ट्री सो that you, it will be helpful for your final examinations in fourth year moving on to here is a beautifully drawn diagram of scamens growth curve uh, this curve is very important you have to remember it and for your to attain your four marks or uh, two marks you have to draw this diagram in your examinations it is very easy and use different colors to attract the examiner so now uh, here is the moving towards the diagram uh, what is this here is one x axis given one y axis uh, on the x axis we are dividing the age like birth 10 years and after the 20 years and on the y axis we are given the size attained as a percentage of the total postnatal growth hence the total growth a uh, postnatal growth is given in the percentage here 0% 100% and 200% okay now the what is actually the scamens growth curve what it is what it will say what it is going to explain us is the body tissues can be broadly divided into four four types okay the those are lymphoid neural general and genital okay four types of tissues are uh, here so we are going to plot the growth of these tissues at what age they are going to grow and uh, at what age they are going to grow up to what percentage okay now uh, here we see that lymphoid tissue proliferates rapidly rapidly in the late childhood and reaches up to the 200% of the adult size as you can see the blue color one the lymphoid one it grows very rapidly and attains the size of 200% of the adult size at the age of 10 years only you can see on the um, x axis here at the age of 10 years it is growing up to the 200% of its adult size this is an adaptation to protect the children from the infection as the children are more prone to the infection so the lymphoid tissues will be growing very rapidly and attaining its 200% and it will protect the child from all the infections which are going on uh, around them okay and afterwards what happens is by about 18 years of age lymphoid tissues undergo involution to reach the adult size up to the 100% as, as you can see here the lymphoid tissue is going down and the it will be attaining the 100% of its growth at the age of 18 to 20 years of age okay uh, here you can uh, clearly appreciate the blue curve which is going up and then slowly coming down and reaching its 100% at the age of 20 years this is nothing but the lymphoid tissue and the next we are moving towards the orange color one line the neural tissue the neural tissue is nothing but our brain and all the tissue grows very rapidly and almost reaches adult size by the age of 6 to 7 years okay at the age of 6 to 7 years it is going to attain its 100% almost 100% uh, up to the age of 6 to 7 years and very little growth of the neural tissues occurs after the 6 to 7 years of age as you can see the curve is going along the 100% line and this uh, will this further growth after 6 to 7 uh, years uh, the neural growth will allow the intake of more further knowledge okay uh, total growth will be uh, total 100% of the growth of the neural tissue will be taken place at the age of 6 to 7 years and afterwards whatever the little growth is going to take place that will help uh, for the intake of the further knowledge of a child okay now moving towards the general tissue the general tissue which we is so shown here it is a wavy curve okay this is nothing but the s shaped curve with rapid growth up to the age of 2 to 3 years it will be showing the rapid growth and the, as the age follows it shows the slow phase of growth after that up to 3 to 10 years you can see the the as the curve is going up and coming slowly down so here it is a s shaped curve okay so you can see the first it rapidly grows up to 2 to 3 years and after 2 to 3 years uh, 3 to 10 years it will be showing a very mild uh, drop of the growth okay after that after the 10th year the rapid phase of growth occurs terminating by the 18 to 
20 years of age. Now the growth will be terminated at the age of 18 to 20 years. The general tissues are nothing but the muscles, bone and the other organs. General tissue is also called as a visceral tissue. Hence it will be completed up to the age of 20 years. Um, so it is very important to remember the S-shaped curve is nothing but the general or the visceral tissue or the organs which are growing nothing but uh, muscles, bones and the other organs. Okay. Now the genital tissue. Okay. Genital tissue consists of the reproductive organs as we all know they show negligible growth until the puberty however they show a rapid growth at the puberty reaching the adult size after which the growth ceases okay after the 20 years of age there is a no growth in the genital organs and uh, and um, up there is only rapid growth of the genital organs at the age of puberty around the puberty hence um, the, the scamans growth curve is explained beautifully in this diagram you have to see the diagram and study it it is very easy to remember and uh, grow through your uh, notes once and uh, i have refer, uh, referred it from the orthodontics balaji you can go through any other book uh, it is easy here so i hope you understood the topic and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel